Okay, day 46. 46 consecutive days of walking at least one mile. Put the camera on and we'll get going. What are you doing, Ranger? What are you doing, buddy? No sun today for you. You already eat? He's already eating. He's not hungry today. Where are you going? You got to come with me on the walk today? Yeah. Hopped right down, huh? You got to stay here. I'll be back in a little while. You got to stay here, okay? All right. All right. Sun, not sunny today. Let me start the timer. We'll get going. All right. Put in your guesses. Gonna do how long I'll go, how long it'll take. Do at least 1.15 today. Not sunny today. And it's the coldest day it's been in a while. And on two coats. About 61 with a wind chill of 54, my guess. See what's going on today. Here's the old VW bug a neighbor has. It's out here every day. Here's this old Argosy RV. I saw that yesterday. Argosy 26. I don't know if they slept in it last night or not. Says it's from 1976. Saw that yesterday. Let's see what we see today. Always something interesting. Yesterday, somebody sitting in their car. Always somebody sitting in their car. Now put in your guesses and we'll see what it is at the end and. Stick around and we'll see what Ranger's doing when I get back. See if he's still waiting. <coughs> Probably will be. Sleeping on top of the chair or something. Let's see what we see today. Yesterday we saw about seven or eight dogs. Petted the two black labs and the yellow lab that lives couple blocks away but the yellow lab is moving I guess they're selling the property so imagine he'll be there two or three more months and that'll be about it here's some white and purple daisies we saw a bunch of purple daisies yesterday these same ones I mean same color they were all purple these are white and purple I see dogs today will make a uh oh is somebody sleeping in the yard or something you're not gonna see too many dogs today I'm gonna walk down the main street so I better put it at about get across here because we're going to walk all the way up put the dogs about two and a half today over under it two and a half see what we see today it's always something I already saw a guy laying in the yard what's he doing there Seemed like I saw him laying in the yard not too long ago. Same place. It's the same guy. But he 
had a yellow, bright yellow vest on like that guy. Maybe that's his place he likes to lay in the yard. I don't know what he does. I thought he was some, the first time I saw him, I thought he was some type of city worker or something, but that was like a month ago. I can go now. here in a little bit see what's going on down here windy windy and not sunny today here comes a bright green something a Porsche GTS bright green Neon green, the color of the year. There's a vet. One time we found a uh, injured seagull. And I went in there to see if they would help come and pick it up, but they wouldn't do it. So we had to call uh, Ow. Animal Services, but they came and got it. That Lincoln Continental still for sale over there. Been uh, for sale for several months now. It's a 68, 69. I think it says on there. Maybe I'll walk past on the other side on the way back. Yeah, definitely not very warm today. Some nice buttercup flowers. I don't know what those are called. They're blooming all over the place now. Well, write down in the comments if uh, you're playing along how many consecutive days you've walked or if you're walking every other day or how it's been going for you if you're just getting started you've been watching the channel and if you want to play along write down your goal if you want to do a mile every day or half a mile a day he is just get going you check back every day and write down your how many days in a row how many miles we can cut across here go see what's going on over here get across the street down this street a little bit. I think I've walked down here in a while. See what we see over here. Took off their shoes and left them in the sidewalk. <laughs> the 
are from South Carolina all the way across the country alright we'll knock down here a block or two already almost at a half a mile doesn't take long 10 minutes out 10 minutes back W bug looks like from the 70s I guess two tone sky blue and white they got new seats in there now that's at least mid to late 70s look at the big tail lights car up here the Grand Torino or something not sure what it is it's from the 70s too and they used to put those bigger tires in the back and jack it up I haven't seen that done in a long time but I remember it not sure what this is it's been customized I think what this thing is I still don't know Ford I had to make a guess Grand Torino but I don't know it is a still not even sure it's a Ford wait till this car comes by or maybe it's in El Camino got the bed in the back Not sure. Maybe it says on the back, but it looks like they took all the tried to turn it into a hot rod. Turned it off, turned all the took all the names of it off. I don't know, I guess a El Camino or something. Mid 70s, early 70s. They'll walk down one more block, turn around. See what we see down here. Yeah. Nice little stained glass on their house. Yellow and white. Daisies blooming. Sure came up like crazy after the rain. What is this thing? Like a chimney or where they could put a fire. You got a boat? Look at that. I don't know what they guess. I don't know if you burn a fire in there or what looks like it like a chimney clay fire pit or something no doesn't look like there's been a fire in there though now the sun comes out a little bit tree some really 
orange oranges. Look at their tangerines. These look like oranges. Oh man, look at all of them. They're already falling off over there. Yeah, fake grass all over the place. Well, it looks nice. Yeah, I think those are oranges. It's full of oranges. Look at that. All right, we've got one more block. Already time to turn around, though. See if we see anything down this block. Walk up the other side. Succulent yard here with the orange cacti. A couple dogs barking. I don't think we're gonna see them. Just hear them barking. Yeah, a lot of cacti. are blooming this time of year. Alright, just gotta turn around here. Head back up this way, walk up the other side of the street. See what's going on up here. I think we've seen one dog. Heard to, heard to. Haven't seen any. We may not see any dogs this whole trip. Head back up to Main Street. Yeah, it's like a, another little lemon tree over there. And we haven't seen any Amazon UPS trucks today. Michael's Cafe. Coming soon. Never seen that before. I'm going to check that out and see what they sell. Probably be $20 sandwiches like everybody else. Can't even eat at Subway anymore. They want like $12 for a foot long. Used to be $5 foot long. $5 foot long is a big commercial. Now it's like $12 foot long. Now it's $5 for a long cookie or something. They used to be trying to sell you on the healthy food. Now they're trying to sell you a foot long cookie. Look at that. Or a foot long pretzel. Or a foot long churro. It doesn't sound so healthy anymore. Hey, 
donut. I think I've eaten there once. And I haven't been to any of those other places. Definitely have not been in the Salvation Army. Have not been in the Skin and Cancer Institute. Have not been in South Bay Hardware. They opened that up it's three or four years ago. I got a hardware store a local hardware store I guess and I don't have any customers there goes one and a screen repair huh. I guess they're trying to establish a little business I think I've been in there once met with a city councilman didn't go well I'll be going in there anytime soon. But here's a tattoo place. I'm not going to be going in there anytime soon either. He's in there getting a tattoo. In the middle of the day. Drinking beer at noon on Tuesday. No cars are going by, it's nice and quiet. Yeah, let me know if you're walking, you've been walking in your neighborhood, or if you have a track you walk on, or you stay in the house and walk on a treadmill. If you walk on a treadmill, put this video up and Like you're walking outside. There's a Bronco. Now I see a Bronco every day. The matte gray Bronco. Popular car, popular color. But I just see a Bronco every day. I don't know what it is. Since I'm looking for it. These guys trying to back in. Huh. What was that? You can like the back end parking places. What that's about. I guess they feel like if they need to make a quick getaway, they back in. Okay, somebody's coming to get them or something. Getting a fight in the chicken Dijon. They gotta get out of there. Get a quick getaway. Texting and walking. Didn't know she was coming up on a street. That could have been dangerous. She looked up just at the last second. Not to walk off the curb. 
seen people texting and walking where they walk into manholes and fountains. And I think texting and driving is awful. Texting and walking can be dangerous. People love to text. I don't really text that much. One text a month. Right. Coming up on this old, old Lincoln. We parked here for, like I said, it seems like two or three, at least a couple of months. Let's see what cars are in here. Sometimes there's an old car in here. Now they walk back here, there's an old car or something. An old Cadillac, it looks like. It's an old car of some sort. It's big. I know what that is, huh? There's that old yellow Impala, I think. Convertible. There's this old Cadillac. I don't know what that is. Cadillac of some sort. What year is your Cadillac? 64. 64, boy, that's sharp. Is it yours? No. Oh. Customer. Customer. Looks good. Wow. Look at that. 64 Cadillac. Yeah, that's a good looking car. Body looks really good. Interior looks nice. Look at that. They got the steering wheel wrapped. It says 67,000 miles. I don't know if those are factory seats. I mean, I kind of doubt it, but I guess it could be. Coupe de Bill. And Chuck Berry used to sing about. If you can see the back two way. Boy, that body looks good. Yeah, that might be everything original. With the steering wheel wrapped and it matches the seats. Oh, let me know if that's original upholstery. Back when they used to have uh, ashtrays in the cars. Wow. It might only be 64,000 miles on that thing. It doesn't look like it's been driven a lot. Wow. over here some older other car over here I don't know what that is huh still don't know what it is Riviera no if it's been customized or not maybe not maybe what it how it came those those headlights it's a Riviera it says Riviera. That's got a nice interior in there too. Let's see what the back looks like. Wow. You know, I'm not sure who makes a Riviera. To be honest. The body looks good too. I don't. Looks like it might have been painted though. Maybe not. I don't know. I don't know who makes Riviera. A good looking car. From the 70s, obviously. I don't know who makes the Riviera. When they used to have the radio antenna that went up. When you turn the radio on, the antenna went up. Good looking car, but I don't know. I don't know the manufacturer. Nice.
What year is that Riviera? Uh, I think it's uh, 63 or 64. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I don't recall seeing one. Who makes Riviera? Um, I don't know. I can't remember. I don't either. <laughs> good looking car. Looked like they kept it in good shape, too, huh? Yeah. Once they take the, the original owner, they take care of it, you know. So. Yeah. I'm not sure if I just the original owner or the best now. Yeah, interesting. Have a good one. No, that was something. We didn't know who makes a Riviera either. Yeah, Mark three that's still for sale. Mark three Continental. I've been for sale for a long time. The Bu I think it's Buick Riviera. Yeah, I think it's Buick. What's this one? No. Buick Riviera. Get across here. Oh. Wait for this. I don't see too many Buicks on the road anymore. I couldn't think of it. I think we used to. We had a Buick Riviera for a minute. It was older than that one. It was from the 70s. I mean, it wasn't as old as that one. That one was, that one was older. Yeah, Buick Riviera. They were big cars. I don't even know if Buick's still in business anymore. I know that... Uh, Tiger Woods first got started. He uh, endorsed. He had an endorsement deal with Buick's. And everybody made fun of him because they didn't think that he would drive a Buick. And now, uh, so about a, three, four, five months ago, two, three months ago, Nike dropped Tiger Woods. They ended their contract. So he's not even endorsed by Nike anymore. I don't know when the last tournament he was. He won, but he's not going to catch... Jack Nicholas, they thought he would run away with the number of majors. I think Jack Nicholas won 18. And he finished second like a ridiculous number of times. Jack Nicholas did like, like another 18 or 20 or 22 times he finished second. Wow, look at this blue is it Tesla. It's like a Sort of like an aqua. Yeah, that's a Tesla. Must be custom. Look at that. Never seen one that color. Aqua marine color. Look at that. No, no license plate in the front. Must have had that custom ordered or custom painted afterwards. They've had it for a minute. Dips in it. Turquoise, maybe. And then uh, Tiger Woods, I think he ended up with uh, 14 majors. And he was winning them left and right. Everybody thought he was going to pass Jack Nicholas. I don't think he's ever going to win another major. He may not ever win another tournament. I think it's been a few years since he won any kind of tournament, let alone a major. He had that car wreck. Was it two couple years ago where he almost he almost lost his leg? It was horrible. But he's playing again, but he was playing in this tournament about six weeks ago, four weeks ago. 
I mean, it's only a couple weeks ago we had to withdraw. There's a bright green truck that's going to try to run over me. Get out of the road. Bright green. Got a piece of sod on the front of it. Ladies direct traffic. Telling people which way to go. What's going on? Trying to get out of the road here. I'm turning left and right. Oh no, now this guy's gonna try to back into a spot. See if he can do it. People aren't so great at parallel parking. If he drives a truck, he'd probably be able to do it. He probably drives all day. Huh? About halfway in. Now he's gonna get a little closer. I think he's gonna do all right. Yep. Back to the Argosy. 76 Argo. So it's going to be parked there a couple days. Or uh, no. This will be the last day. They got to do street cleaning tomorrow. So better move it or ticket it. Look at it. It's holding, weighing down the truck. Ooh. Heavy. Must have a lot in that thing. Or it weighs a lot. Pull that. Yukon off its front wheels. All right. Now that was kind of interesting. We saw that was a '63 Cadillac and a Buick Riviera. Interesting cars. There's a neighbor's Cadillac here. I think this is a 63 too. It's a four door though. It looks even bigger than the black one. I see that almost every day. All right. All right. Let's see what the final number is for today. If you guessed. 1.66 in 36 minutes and 48 seconds. You are the winner. Nice walk. A little bit different route. Saw some interesting things. Always seems like you see a vintage car of some sort. The Ranger's asleep on the chair. He likes to sleep on top of that chair. It's hardly enough room for his body. Looks like his favorite place to sit. What are you doing, buddy? That's your favorite place? Did you fall asleep while I was gone already? There he goes. What are you doing, little guy? You wanna come over and say hello? Wow. What? Oh, sorry, buddy. I hit on your tail. He had his tail underneath where I was sitting. <laughs> sorry about that, little guy. <laughs> You're like Woodstock in the Snoopy, <laughs> Snoopy cartoons. Charlie Brown. Yeah! <laughs> sorry about that, little guy. You all right? <laughs> you, you're not too happy about that, were you? Set out a little piece of your tail. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> Must have just barely gotten you. You don't seem too upset about it. <laughs> Sorry about that, little guy. You okay? <laughs> Purring now. <laughs> You want a treat? Yeah? All right, I'll get you a treat. All right, that's about it for today. 
If you like the video, subscribe, check out last couple videos. We saw that tree with some type of melons on it that were big as a bowling ball. That was a couple days ago. Never seen anything like that. Petted the barking dogs yesterday, if you want to see that. I'll put a link here to one of the videos I think you might like. Check out some of those. I get a uh, ranger a treat here and then we'll cut it off. Oh, you want a treat, huh, buddy? You want to shake today? Yes? No? You up for it? No? All right, here you go. No, no shaking today. Since you've got your tail set on. All right, that's it. See you tomorrow.